Welcome to this uh, tech security channel and uh, well in an interesting test done by AV test uh, which tests of course security of different uh, programs different sources and how you know it can detect certain um, problems they found that the Google Play protect which is now on all our Android phones and tablets, which is basically something that's supposed to protect us and let us know that the apps we're downloading are okay and that don't have malware in them, is not that great. They were saying that in a six months average that they did, uh, and they actually sent it um, a lot of different apps and a lot of things, it detected... Um, you know, problems and only 66% of the time. So, you know, that is something to be careful of. That that shows us that we got to be careful about the apps that we have on our computers. Make sure that we choose the proper ones because it's obvious that that is telling us that the Play Protect on its own is not enough. I often talk about security and I often talk about the fact that antivirus is not what protects us. And here's an example, because this is supposed to protect us from bad apps and malware on our Android devices. You know what? The best way to protect us is to stay within the store, but also to stay with the standard apps. Not go and click and download everything we see. And of course, side loading of Android apps is a bad idea for security reasons. But um, I think here Google needs to... Uh, up the security here and not just with Google Play Protect it needs to verify more the apps that are in the store because so many times we've seen that some apps are either snooping on you more than they should or that they contained you know all sorts of tracking that was not something you wanted and um, even malware so I hope that this gets better over time. But uh, be careful what you do with your Android devices. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.